السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ شبہات کا ازالہ پیج کو سبسکرائب کریں اور بیل آئکن دبائیں سب سے پہلے ویڈیو دیکھنے کے لیے دا کانسپیرنسی آف مس چیف مونگرس ان ریونڈ مرکز پوائنٹ نمبر 1 In 1998, some people, namely Masih al-Zama, Dr. Salim, Dr. Nadeem Ashraf, Molvi Iftiqar al-Zama, Molvi Ziya al-Haq, were caught working for outside enemies of Islam. Elements. Thereafter, led by Abdul Latif Saab, led by Shabir Saab and by Yamin Saab Karachi, who was a spokesman, was brought to the notice of late Haji Abdul Wahab Saab and Malana Jamshid Saab with valid proof to highlight this conspiracy. Haji Abdul Wahab Saab, Mufti Zainul Abedin Saab, Maulana Jamshed Ali Saab decided to empty their computer room and send them out to a foreign countries for a period of one year in Jamaat. And on return to Raivan, these people would be asked to return to their respective homes. Two people who opposed this was Maulana Ahsan Ulaq Saab and Maulana Tariq Jamil Saab. Point number two. Mashura was made to remove Molvi Abdul Rahman Saab, Molvi Khurshid Saab and Molvi Fahim Saab would answer a few questions. Thereafter, Maulana Ahsan Ulaq Saab and Maulana Tariq Jamil Saab took the help of Nizamuddin and got a decision that these ulama would be granted entry after a year back in Raivan. Point number three. Bhai Yamin Saab was instrumental in creating differences between Maulana Saad Sahib and Haji Abdul Wahab Saab on the matter of Muntakhab Ahadis. Point number four, Maulana Jamshed Saab and Haji Abdul Wahab Saab were imprisoned inside the Markaz. Point number five, Maulvi Fahim Saab gave poison to Haji Abdul Wahab Saab. Qureshi Hazrat intervened to remove Maulvi Fahim from the service of Haji Abdul Wahab Saab. Point number six, Maulvi Suhail, the brother of Maulana Ahsan al Saab, printed a book titled Trade in Islam and this was personally distributed by him in as many as 100 branches of Raven. Not only was he distributed against this book, he even established a system for money to be collected, collected from people. What happened? Poor people, 3 trillion rupees was moved from Malaysia to Canada. Malvi Tariq Jamil Saab, Mian Ahsan, Naeem Bhatt and Malvi Fahim were saved from this scandal through some established ulama, students and persons holding posts in government from the contributors. Point number seven. Around seven members of Pakistani Shura and around 30 residents of Raivan were assaulted and scared by students, teachers to be removed from Raivan. Point number eight. Bhai Yamin Sahab goes to Nizamuddin to encourage and instigate Maulana Ahmed Lad Sahab, Maulana Ibrahim Dola Sahab and Farooq Sahab against Maulana Saad Sahab. Point number nine. In 2015, during Raivan Dishtema, in a closed room, Alame Shura was formed without the consent of Haji Abdul Wahab Sahab, Maulana Saad Sahab, nor the Pakistani Shura, nor the Bangladeshi Shura. This formation was rejected by ha both Haji Abdul Wahab Sahib and Maulana Saad Sahib. And this is what triggered the break throughout the world. Point number 10. Those, those who left Nizamuddin on their own, for example, Maulana Ahmed Lad Sahib, Ibrahim Dola Sahib and companions were invited to Raven for Ishtemas and also taken along to different countries to establish new Marakis and create an environment of opposition against Maulana Saad Sahib. It is a known fact that since the last four months, the people of Mewat in general, including their ulama Ikram and elders, have been coming in large numbers for the monthly mashwara and presenting letters and presenting the following requests. Nizamuddin be accepted as the markaz of entire world as it used to be. Number two, Maulana Saad Sahib being the last and only person left from the shura formed by late Hazraji Maulana Inamul Hassan Sahib Rahmatullah Aleh is our Amir. Number three, those who are working for our enemies be removed from the important responsibilities in Raven Markas, be removed from these responsibilities and be sent out in the path of Allah like the rest of the masses. Number four, those people who were sent out of Raven Markas for no rhyme or season without Mashura be re reinstated and brought back to 
take over those responsibilities once more number 5 the harassment that the mewatis have been subjected to in this period be brought to account number 6 unaccountability of the founds within raven be edited and scrutinized note all the above mentioned charges be taken into account by questioning shura members one by one in isolation amongst those to be questioned are by us usuf qureshi sahab by harun qureshi sahab by quaz ya sahab by babar javed sahab by hashmat sahab by shahid sahab by bakht munir sahab by peer azam shah by sultan iqbal sahab by dr naushad sahab by farid paracha sahab by gulam mustafa sahab by dr manzoor sahab by irshad sahab except these two persons dr ruhulla sahab choudhary rafiq sahab those people residents of raven markaz who were tortured and assaulted like bhai faiz hamid sahab bhai dr ashraf sahab bhai raja mohammad afsar sahab and bhai umar akbar sahab besides this 30 others be questioned likewise 90% from the current 500 to 600 residents be questioned to know the facts amongst the mewatis molvi sharif sahab bhai mohammad riyaz sahab bhai master usman sahab bhai mohammad wasim sahab bhai master riyaz sahab bhai molvi ilya sahab bhai mufti hasnain sahab bhai imran sahab and molvi mahmud sahab etc etc be question to mianji abdullah's children and his relatives request to raven firstly these people removed f- the founder mianji abdullah and his children from the markaz then they closed the doors of markaz on these people through guards they disgraced their women and assaulted them and framed them in false cases empty places belonging to the mewatis were land grabbed and finally stopped and finally stopped them from meeting haji abdul wahab sahab the mewat istima and also bayat allegations since 2015 our peer amir e mahataram hazrat ji malana saad sahab is being stopped from istima all of this we patiently withstood now we really realize now we realize that you are bent upon finishing nizamuddin and our amir molana saad sahab we the people of mewat will never allow this to happen and those who are working for our enemies will never be allowed to stay in revered inshallah